Now let's introduce the company's Zay W5110DC resistance tester. First connect the test line and connect the corresponding port of the instrument according to the color of the test line. Connect the current U-type terminal and tighten it. Plug the other end into the corresponding voltage port. The black test line is connected in the same way as the red one. Then clamp the test clamp to the A and B phases of the transformer, respectively. After the test line is connected, turn on the power. Click the first parameter setting. First enter the actual ambient temperature. This is the converted temperature automatically displayed by the instrument. This is the tap position selection of the transformer. Customers can choose according to the actual conditions of the test. This item is the material of the transformer. Here we choose copper. This item is for phase selection, which can be selected according to the test wiring method. The last item is the current test. You can choose according to your needs or choose the automatic mode. After setting up, click to start testing. The instrument starts testing. The instrument displays the experimental results. The upper part is the experimental test value, and the lower part shows the converted value. When the test is completed, click to print. Click return. The instrument will beep and start discharging automatically. The staff can switch the test phase only after the discharge is completed. After the test clamp is switched, other parameters on the interface remain unchanged. You only need to change the phase and select automatic current test, then click to start the test. The instrument starts automatic testing. After the results are displayed, the upper right corner of the instrument shows that the current is 5A. After two tests, the instrument shows 5A. You can directly select 5A for the next test. After the test is finished, click Return and the instrument will start to discharge automatically. After the discharge is finished, switch the test phase. After the test clamp is switched, just change the phase selection on the interface and select 5A for the current test. Click to start the test. After the test is finished, click Return and the instrument will start to discharge automatically. After discharging is completed, click Return. The second item on the interface is Data Management. After entering the interface, you can see all test results. You can delete data, check the next data, check the previous data, print the data, and you can also use a USB flash drive to export the experimental data. Click Return to return to the main interface. The third item is System Settings. You can set the instrument screen brightness and background color. Click Return. The fourth item is time modification, which can be modified according to the customer's situation. 
After the test is completed, shut down the machine. First remove the wiring test clamp on the transformer, and finally remove the test wire from the instrument port to ensure the safety of the test personnel. This is the overall structure and test process of the instrument. 